Football is often reduced to numbers, the stats of each game telling in detail what happened on the field. Each play, each drive, each Saturday afternoon can be found in the numbers. Here at Xavier University, football is about numbers too. Like 1901, the first year the team took the field, and 1918 when Coach Joseph Meyer started his 16-game coaching career and tallying 14 winning seasons. How about 35, 12, and 2? That's the record of Coach Ed Kluska. In his four years as head coach of the Musketeers, his teams outscored their opponents nearly 2-1. to one. 1950 is a number Xavier fans soon won't forget. That's the year the Musketeers beat Arizona State in the Salad Bowl, which later became known as the Fiesta Bowl. The opposing coach said Xavier was one of the best teams I've ever seen anywhere. His name was Paul Bear Bryant. Another record year was 1951, when the Musketeers went undefeated. A perfect 10-0 year, and the only time a Xavier sports team has had a perfect season. Nine is the number of players that made it to the NFL. But in 1973, we found out about another more ominous number, 200,000. That's how much Xavier was losing each year on the football program. That's when the Board of Trustees voted to drop the sport. But now, in 2006, Xavier has a new football program and a new group of numbers for Xavier football fans to consider. Like 33, that's the number of years since a football team associated with Xavier has taken the field. And one, the first year and a new story for club football at Xavier. And for the first victory this club is looking for today. So get ready, football is coming back to Xavier University for the first time since 1973. The Xavier Football Musketeers are back. They meet the club for Marquette next. Musketeers! Oh, boy, boy, boy.